Hello everyone, welcome back to Outdoor Berlin. Today we will guide you step by step on how to use DTS Monaco. The most powerful diagnostic and coding software for Mercedes-Benz. Whether you're completely new or already using Zentry, this series will help you unlock the full potential of DTS. Here's what we'll cover throughout this training. Module 1, Introduction and Environment Setup. You'll learn what DTS Monaco is, how to set up your interface like C4, C6, Tabscan T6, or VCX SE, and how to work with project files such as .smr and .cbf. Module 2, Mastering the Interface and Basic Functions. We'll go deep into flash programming and variant coding, so you understand how each feature works. Module 3, Practical Repair Exercises and Advanced Tips. You'll see real-world repair examples and learn advanced tricks to work faster and safer. In our previous video, we explored the functions and interface of the DTS Monaco software. In this video, we'll go deeper, and I'll show you how to connect DTS Monaco with diagnostic interfaces like C4, C6, and Tabscan T6 Zentry and Tabscan T6 Elite. Let's start with the SD Connect C4. First, make sure your C4 device is properly connected to your vehicle's OBD port and your laptop. Launch DTS Monaco. You will see the license agreement. Click Yes, I am to continue. The software will now initialize the base system. Choose Administrate and Manage DTS Projects. In the main menu, go to Tools and select System Setting. Choose the interface. Locate and select the SD Connect SMR entry, which corresponds to your C4 device. Ensure the physical links show the correct vendor and module type. Now we need to confirm the connection status. The system will start detecting the interface. Make sure your C4 device is properly connected to your computer, typically via a network cable. Great! The status has changed to connected and the serial number is now displayed. This confirms the C4 device is successfully configured. Next, we will open a workspace to start diagnosing. Click on Temporary Workspace under the Start Execution Mode section. Navigate to the folder containing your SMR files, select all the relevant files for your model, in this case the BR205, and click Open to load them into the Temporary Workspace. Choose the template for your workspace. Now, the DTS Monaco software is opened successfully. Now let's move to the SD Connect C6. The first steps are almost identical to the C4 setup. Connect your C6 to the vehicle and your laptop. Launch the DTS Monaco software. Navigate to File and select System Setting. In the left panel, click on Interfaces. We are looking for the C6 Diagnostic Interface, which is typically identified as ISO DOP SMR and VCI module. Ensure your C6 device is powered on and connected to your network. The system will start detecting the interfaces. Pause for detection. Success! The status now shows Connected along with the serial number. This confirms the DTS software recognizes the C6 VCI. Close the System Configurator window. Now, we will prepare the diagnostic session by opening a temporary workspace. Click on Temporary Workspace. You must load the necessary SMR files for the vehicle you intend to work on. Navigate to the SMR file repository, select the desired files for the BR205 model and click Open. Choose a template that matches your vehicle type and the SMR data you loaded. That concludes the configuration and setup process for the MBC6 with DTS Monaco. You are now ready to begin your diagnostic and engineering work. Now, let's take a quick look at two newer interfaces from Tabscan, the T6 Zentry and T6 Elite. These tools are relatively new to the market, so not many technicians know about them yet. However, they are incredibly powerful, easily comparable to traditional Mercedes interfaces like the C4 or C6. What makes the Tabscan devices special is their remote operation capability. That means you can connect and perform diagnostics or coding from anywhere without needing to install the original Zentry software on every computer. This feature makes them extremely convenient for multi-location workshops or mobile technicians. Now, let's take a look at the Tabscan T6 Elite. This is one of the latest diagnostic interfaces from Tabscan, designed to work not only with Mercedes, but also with a wide range of vehicle brands. It's a truly multi-brand diagnostic tool, supporting functions like coding, programming, and ECU flashing, all through one compact and modern device. First, we need to set the VCI preference in the Config Assist tool. Wait for the configuration settings to be applied. It's often helpful to quickly check your VCI status. Launch your Tabscan VCI Manager application to monitor the device health and connection.
Next, ensure your VCI Manager software is properly installed or updated. Navigate to the installation file. Run the setup wizard and complete the installation process. Once the manager is installed, open it and navigate to the settings menu. It is crucial to have the latest drivers and firmware. Perform a check for updates and proceed with the update and restart if prompted. The information of the devices is displayed here. Now, go to the Drivers tab, select Benz and click Install Local Driver. This step ensures proper communication between the VCI and DTS Monaco. We are now ready to launch the DTS Monaco software. Click Yes I Am to accept the warning and wait for the application to load. On the main screen, select Temporary Workspace. This will prompt you to load the diagnostic data. Navigate to your stored SMR files, select all the necessary ECUs for your project e.g. BR205 and click Open. A template selection box appears. Choose the appropriate SMR Diagnostic CAN template and click Finish to load the workspace. Now the DTS Monaco is opened successfully. You can do variant coding or flash programming as you wish. Now, let's take a deeper look at the TabScan T6 Xentry. While the T6 Elite is already strong and very capable, the T6 Xentry steps it up with features specifically optimized for Mercedes-Benz systems and full compatibility with engineering software such as DTS Monaco and Xentry. Once connected, you'll notice the LED indicators light up, the network adapter shows up in Windows, and DTS Monaco identifies the T6 Xentry automatically as Ecom Interface. We begin by locating the TabScan Manager setup file. Right-click the file and choose Run as Administrator to start the installation. Follow the on-screen prompts. Launch the TabScan Manager application. You will be prompted to install the device driver. Click Install. Next, go to the Drivers section. As you can see, this device can be used for Mercedes vehicle only, different form TabScan T6 Elite. We need to install the necessary vehicle drivers. Click Install for the Benz driver, and then click Install for the JT534-0404 driver as well. Return to the Device tab and click Update to check for the latest software and firmware versions. Click Update again to begin the update process for system, COEM and firmware. Wait for the update to complete, and then click Confirm. Now, we will launch the DTS Monaco software. Read the warning message carefully, and if you agree to the terms, click Yes I Am to proceed. We need to verify the interface configuration. Open the system configuration, navigate to the interfaces section. The system will start detecting connected interfaces. Confirm that your TabScan T6X entry is detected and displays a connected serial number, SN. Restart DTS Monaco. Again, select Temporary Workspace. Browse and select the appropriate diagnostic data file, often referred to as a DBR file. Now, choose the corresponding workspace template for your vehicle and click Finish. The workspace is now successfully loaded and you are ready to use your TabScan T66 entry device with DTS Monaco for diagnosis and programming. DTS Monaco is an extremely powerful tool for diagnostics and programming on Mercedes vehicles. It supports a wide range of key functions, such as ECU flashing, coding, variant coding, CAN signal testing and control module diagnostics, delivering tremendous real-world value, from troubleshooting complex faults and programming new modules to conducting advanced technical research. Currently, we're also releasing a comprehensive guidebook series on DTS Monaco. DTS Monaco Guidebook Mercedes-Benz, Diagnostic and Programming for Rookie. Designed for beginners, it helps you get started from the basics, compatible devices, software interface, and the ECU coding and programming process. DTS Monaco, Advanced, Volna 2, Unlock 100 Hidden Features on Mercedes-Benz, focuses on advanced techniques, including coding methods to unlock hundreds of hidden features on Mercedes vehicles. 
In the coming weeks, we'll be releasing a series of videos that explain each function in detail and provide hands-on tutorials with the DTS Monaco software. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the Auto Explain channel so you won't miss our upcoming in-depth videos.